All right, everybody, welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by, I appreciate it. Today, I'm gonna to be comparing my old apron, which is the Carhartt, and I don't know any model number on that, but it's this one right here. My car, old Carhartt apron with my new Klein Tools apron. I use this for the first time today. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys what I like and what I don't like about each one of them if you are randomly deciding between these two aprons. So like I said in the last video, um, I really like the fact that you can um, just go ahead and pull on this strap right here to tighten it or loosen it. Um, and the clip is really nice. Um, the, both of the clips are really nice. This one is a little bit smaller. I like the fact that this is a little more compact um, and the, the quality of material is probably gonna be a little bit better because this is a canvas, so it's stronger. Um, you do have your like two hammer spots right here or if you wanted to like put a tape measure on there or something, I don't know what you wanna do with your belt. But I use this one for like a month, month and a half, like I said, at the job site that I've been working at. Um, and like I said, I don't really like the fact that these pockets are kind of small. And if you put tools in like the front, then the back gets like really hard to use. And if you put your tools in the back, then the front gets really hard to use. So there's not much room if you put your tools in here to like move stuff around or get stuff from the bottom. Um, but I do like putting my phone in this left pocket right here and then um, obviously the larger tools or like the pliers and the dikes and needle nose stuff going here and like your pens and pencils along there. So that's kind of how I lay my stuff out. Um, you do have two little pockets right here which I just learned about recently for like pens and pencils or even like a pocket knife. Um, but yeah, overall I really like this but I just don't like the fact that it is hard to get stuff out with the pockets. That's basically my main problem right there. That's why I went ahead and bought the new Klein Tools one. Um, so as you can see here, you have your your pocket depth right here. They're pretty skinny. Um, they're not very big at all. Um, and then here is the new Klein Tools one. As you can see, this first pocket right here is enormous um, and you have a lot of room. You can put a whole tape measure in here and take it out. If you try to put a tape measure in this one, it barely probably fits, let alone trying to take it out. Um, so I, I really love this one, which is why I bought it for the big pocket right here. Um, the things that I don't like about this one right here um, is the fact that it's just so big because I'm a small person. Um, so there is a ton of extra tail right here. So I went ahead and zip tied that this morning before I started work. Um, and it, that doesn't really get in the way of trying to get into this pocket right here. Uh, but if it did, then I could just flip it back and then zip tight on this side. So I'm not really worried about the tail. In worst case, I could cut it off and like melt it back with like a lighter or something. Um, but anyways, here is the clip on this one. It's really big. Um, so there's the clip right there. Um, the materials look pretty good on this, but I think a canvas would have been stronger. Um, obviously, you could probably cut through this pretty easily if you had a blade or a razor blade. Um, you could probably stab through it pretty easily if you tried, but I'm not going to. Um, but the belt is a little bit thicker right here. You do have a few more options with the tape ring right here, which I went ahead and secured this other thing down so it's just hanging sideways. But this is like for a tape measure, I believe, right here. And you do have the uh, uh, hammer holder right here again, right there. The hammer holder is the hole right there. Um, you only have one on this one, the Carhartt one, you do have two. Um, so if you're like a 32 inch waist, which is pretty much what I am, then this barely fits you. Um, literally like you have like three inches to spare. Um, depends on where you want this. Um, I wanted it a little bit lower, so I pulled a little bit out, but if you want it higher, then it just barely fits you like with the belt clip right to the edge of the belt. Uh, the apron so anyways i do love the fact that you can put so many things in here easy to grab in here no problem uh, but these back pockets are actually a little bit tighter than the carhartt which i don't like so i don't like that these are even tighter than the last one i really wish it was just a little bit deeper which would have been perfect and would have probably made this like a 10 out of 10 or like a 9 out of 10 because of the material um so yeah i really the only complaint would be just the the extra belt 
is annoying um, but that's I mean that is what it is but the pockets could have been fixed I think a little bit deeper pockets on the back would have been great I do like the fact that there's two pockets over here you can put your pens pencils a knife um, just like a single screwdriver some screwdrivers in there whatnot um, but yeah big pockets are the main reason why I bought this which I already love today which I tried out they do need to sink in a little bit because they haven't been used yet so it's still kind of like crinkly so I do need to break that in but other than that I really really like this so far uh, I still put my phone in this pocket which is nice to keep it tight and this is like I said it is a tight pocket right here but it is easy to use with your your taller tools with your nine inch lineman your 10 inch snipex uh, your needle nose anything like that or your nine inch diagonal cutters maybe even your eight inch diagonal cutters so it is nice and is not as bad as I thought to use but as far as the front pockets goes they're completely amazing um, and that's pretty much my comparison um, it is a little bit longer I believe if you hold this up next to it it is a little bit I think it's a little bit taller mm, one second yeah it's like a extra two inches as you can see right there if I'm holding these up completely even then it's about inch inch and a half about an inch and a half longer um, this is a little bit more flexible right here and this is a little bit more stiffer um, just one thing to consider um, yeah I wouldn't take a knife to this to do like a durability test to it right now because given this one to my coworker, and obviously I just bought this and I'm using it so I'm not going to do like a, a I'm not going to cut it open with a knife or anything like that but if I got if I had a couple of these then I totally would do it like a hardcore review but we're not at that stage yet in this YouTube channel to destroy things for free so anyways those are my thoughts and comparisons on them so hopefully this video helped you out um as always if you enjoyed don't forget to drop a like on the video and uh, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already it would help out the channel and i would love to see you guys back in the next video and uh, that's going to do it for this one thank you guys so much for watching as always um i'll see you in the next one and god bless peace